canine cognitive dysfunction is the equivalent to and similar to Alzheimer's disease in man. Uh, canine cognitive dysfunction is a syndrome which was created to fit age-related change in animals, specifically the dog, both normal as well as pathologic entities. Cognitive dysfunction is actually a descriptive syndrome based on mannerisms or behaviors and animals that age undergo changes of degeneration of the nervous system, normal and abnormal. Some of the behaviors that we have noted in animals during aging are related to cognition. Cognition is a summation of memory and of learning, and when one process fails, everything fails. So with canine cognitive dysfunction, there is a failure of normal learning, processing, and memory. Animals typically become disoriented more than normal. Owners can find them wandering in the house. They can find them behind objects, behind doors. They can forget which door to go out of when they go outside. They also have a change in interaction, the interaction with the family. The animal doesn't come greet you at the door anymore. They tend to sleep more, and that's the third category. That is a sleep change or a sleep disorder. Animals tend to sleep more during the daytime versus the night. They tend to spend more of nighttime walking, pacing the house, restless or anxiety ridden. The other forms that we see with cognitive dysfunction are related to simple training habits. They forget what they've learned. Bathroom training, house training, fecal accidents, urinary accidents are not uncommon. And the last is exercise. Exercise levels change and the energy and desire to exercise changes all dwindle and disappear.